Hi, my name is Elizabeth and I'm going to show you how to use limiters. By the end of this tutorial, you will be able to use limiters to narrow down your search results to find exactly what you need. Using Scout can bring you thousands of results of all different types. News articles, academic journals, ebooks, physical books, statistics, photographs. With all these results, sifting through all of the records can be overwhelming. To help narrow down the results to exactly what you want, you can use limiters. Limiters are filters that narrow down your search results. Starting from the Scout Advanced Search page, let's search for zombies and popular culture. This search results in thousands of possibilities. We could sift through all of the results, or we could use the boxes on the left side of the results page to filter out what we don't need. There are several categories to refine your results. A common one is the scholarly or peer-reviewed journals limiter that filters out everything except academic journals. Peer-reviewed articles are authored by experts in their respective fields and the articles have been approved by other experts as high quality research. Some professors request that you use academic journals in your research. To display only these types of journal articles, just click the box called Scholarly Peer Reviewed Journals. Using this limiter will display only journal articles that match this criteria. If academic journals are not what you need, just click the X to close the limiter. Then scroll down to the source type box and choose your resource this way. For example, if you only want to find news and magazine articles, choose the appropriate boxes and then click update. There are several other sets of limiters that you can use including geography, language, publication date, and subject. Using limiters can save you time and narrow your research so that you can find the resources you need with just a few clicks. Thank you for watching this video. If you have any questions about limiters or research, visit us at lib.ua.edu or stop by the library.